So I'm starting by talking to Justin Miller, the CEO and co-founder of New Hero, who has won this year's Dr. Mal Bryce Tech Company of the Year Award. Since 2015, New Hero has cre been creating a significant new smart hearing market category that bridges high-end earbud technology and sophisticated hearing technology. Their IQ Buds 2 Max won three innovation awards at CES 2020, the world's leading consumer electronics show in Las Vegas. And it's considered to be the world's most advanced hearing bud with more advanced functionality than any earbud on the market, including the Apple AirPods Pro, Google Pixel Buds, Jabra Elite Buds. So congratulations to you and your team at New Hero, Justin. Thank you, Charlie. Uh, it's a pleasure to be honored in such a way as WA Tech Company of the Year. New Hero is uh, proudly Western Australian. We've done uh, our concentration of uh, our staff are in Western Australia. Yep. Um, most of our uh, sales are done offshore, in fact, more than 80%. So uh, it's wonderful that, one, we can get to play in a global space out of Western Australia, and, uh, and two, obviously be acknowledged by, by West Australians as, uh, as, a, as a proud export. It's, it's fantastic. So how did the idea come about for New Hero and, uh, and the smart hearing technology you've been developing? Yeah, uh, my co-founder and my, uh, David Cannington and myself, um, about six years ago, uh, having uh, worked together in an industrial hearing um, company, and uh, we, uh, we heard the same thing continually, which was difficulty with accessibility and affordability in hearing products. So we thought, well, you know, there, there, there's a market. You hear something enough, you think that there's a market there. And that idea, through some very, very uh, experienced technologists, Right, um, David and I aren't that, right. um, but with some very experienced technologists, we're able to build products. And now with our third generation product, we're, we're really taking the world by storm. And then recently you were named as Time Magazine's top 100 inventions of 2020. That's an enormous thing to happen. How did that come about and, and what's resulted? In yeah. Incredible result for us, for Western Australia, for the company, and incredible recognition. As the Australian, only Australian company on that list. Right. Uh, but to be on the front cover of Time magazine, it's, uh, well, I mean, I'm still getting my hair around it, quite frankly. Right. I mean, it's, it's to go from an idea to the front cover of Time magazine is, yeah. is incredible. But it, it, it validates the category. It validates what we're trying to do. There's a real need there. And, uh, and Time recognised that through, through this award. That's fantastic. So what are the plans for 2021 and beyond? And, and what will be the focus for the business going forward? Uh, for us, accessibility and affordability morphs into personalization. So it's more about how, how do we bring personalization to the things we wear on our ears. And uh, hopefully we're talking less about hearing loss and more about personalization. And there's a number of use cases that we'll bring into that, um, that, that will bring more products to market. But it's also in collaboration as well. We recently announced a collaboration with HP yeah. and, uh, and in us building products uh, and technology for, for HP. It's bringing big tech from other parts of the world into, into Perth and Western Australia. Yeah. And that's an exciting, proposition for us in 2021. Well, no doubt there have been challenges in 2020, but congratulations on your year and all the best for 2021. Thank you, Charlie. And beyond the new hero. Appreciate Justin it. Justin Mellon.